King Charles has no time in the diary to see Prince Harry when the Duke returns to the UK next week ahead of the Invictus Games, it has been reported. The Duke of Sussex, 38, will be travelling to the UK to attend the annual Well Child Awards, a charity of which he has been patron for 15 years. However, a palace insider told Mail Online that the king had no time in the diary to see his son, while his brother Prince William is not thought to have been in touch with Harry for months. The observation comes days after Prince Harry's latest Netflix docuseries Heart of Invictus was released on the popular streaming giant. Queen Camilla and Princess Anne Ezel in Tartan for major Scottish event during the series, the Duke launched a fresh attack, saying that he had no support structure to help him cope with the sudden death of his mother at the age of 12. He said, the biggest struggle for me was no one around me really could help. I didn't have that support structure, that network, or that expert advice to identify what was actually going on with me. In another segment during the show, the Duke of Sussex talks about the post-traumatic stress disorder PTSD, and trauma in war zones, and appears to make a swipe at the royal family by saying that his trauma was never discussed. Don't miss! Charles and Camilla look delighted as they watch late Queen's favorite event, Insight, Meghan Markle's worrying premonition before her first meeting with late Queen, Reveal, Photos sparked feud between Meghan Markle and Queen Camilla, Spotlight, he said, Look, I can only speak to me own experience but from my tour of Afghanistan in 2012 flying Apaches, somewhere after that there was an unraveling. And the trigger for me was actually returning from Afghanistan but the stuff that was coming up was from 1997 from the age of 12. Losing my mum at such a young age. The trauma I had I was never aware of. He went on to explain how he never spoke about his feelings. Harry said, it was Bever discussed and I didn't really talk about it and I suppressed it like most other youngsters would have done when it all came fizzing out I was bouncing off the walls, what is going on here? Dash I am now feeling everything instead of being young. The biggest struggle for me was no one around me really could help. I didn't have that support structure, that network or that expert advice to identify what was actually going on with me. Unfortunately like most of us the first time you consider therapy is when you are lying on the floor in the fetal position probably wishing you had dealt with some of this stuff previously. And that's what I really want to change. Thank you.